Christina from hauntedflower.com and hauntedflowerreviews.com and today I'm going to be reviewing Hugo. Hugo is a new attempt from Martin Scorsese. This is a children's or family film. It's based on a book by Brian Selznick and is the story of an orphan boy in 1930s Paris who has been operating the clocks at a train station by himself. There's a deeper mystery though because he recently lost his father, played by Jude Law, and his father left him basically this automaton. It was like the one thing he could save from his memory of his father, and it's kind of like a robot, but not. You know, it's something that you wind up and then it would do something, and the boy is trying to fix it to figure out what it does. The boy's name obviously is Hugo, and he is played by Asa Butterfield, if that's how you say his name. Uh, along the way, he runs into Ben Kingsley, who is playing Georges Millier, and this guy uh, runs like a little toy shop, and there's a mystery around him, too, and the two of them are always at odds because Hugo's been stealing from him to get parts to fix his automaton. Georges is also the guardian of young Isabel, who's played by Chloe Moretz. And I have to say, I always love Chloe Moretz. I don't think that this one is her best work, but I still really enjoy her character because she's so charming and enthusiastic and has a great vocabulary. There are a lot of other actors rounding out the cast too. The station agent, which is basically kind of the mall cop for the train station, is played by Sasha Baron Cohen. And he is interested in uh, Flower Girl, who is played by Emily Mortimer. Also, there's a librarian on the scene, and he's played by Christopher Lee. I would describe this movie as ma like a magical mystery. The two kids working together, trying to have new experiences, figure out what this automaton does, how it relates to them, and perhaps to Georges. And it's just really cool. The, the 3D effects are kind of neat. This is Martin Scorsese's first 3D film, too. And there are just moments that are very emotional. I really, really enjoyed the score, all this like French music playing. It's like Ratatouille, but way better. And I just thought it was a sweet story. I, I was really engaged in it. I thought it was really, really fantastic. And I would definitely recommend that you and your family go check it out. Thank you for watching my review for Hugo. And I hope you'll join me next time for another movie review. Bye. For more reviews and to find out about free contest giveaways, go to hauntedflowerreviews.com. My reviews are also available as a podcast on iTunes. Search for Haunted Flower Reviews and subscribe and leave us feedback and comments. Our store is hauntedflower.com, where we specialize in fantastic licensed apparel from movies, TV shows, video games, anime, and more. You can find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash hauntedflower and Twitter at haunted underscore flower. If you're local to the Indianapolis area, visit IndieMojo.com for details on how you can win free screening passes.